Good morning, YouTube folks. How you doing? Got my little fisheye lens on here. I want to see what we're looking at in a different scope. This old Mr. Sun, he's always around. Well, hope you've been enjoying my new video styles. Trying to bring it, mix it up, guys. System coming up right there. There's your system. It's coming up from the south like it does every day at 11 o'clock. I'm going to continue this video part by part. And uh, same lens. And I might swap it out. Depends. Stay tuned. If your heart is aching, it's a law that you're breaking your quarantine. So don't be mean. Ah, 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 ah. All I do is look at memes. Ah, ah, ah. The fish eye lens gives it a good. It curves the sky so you can see kind of the whole thing. And, uh, you know, when R2, big white planet comes over, you, you see all these popcorn trails and. Stuff. And it's just, it'll go over and then you'll see other items come through. Here's a little bit different view of the west side. See, it all just, just kind of just comes through. And it's so huge. You just don't see the whole thing because it takes up the whole sky. It sounds crazy, right? But it ain't. Now this right here is looking from a, um, I just turned to the north. I don't know what the sun's gonna show. I can't even see it, but I like to get this shot. Huge, freaking huge. Get back my vision. Okay. Then you can see how it's coming up like a ball right there. And you see how this already is coming over. Well, right above the fence line, you'll see how white it gets. See how it gets really white? That's part of the system still coming out. Now the sun's right here. Yeah, so we're just like right here north. I mean south. And you can see exactly how it's all coming up. You see usually these clouds, elongated clouds. And then I picked up all this from learning from Samuel Hoffman. Now look over here in the distance. You see the ripples? It's a good indication that the magnetic fear, magnetic, <clears throat> magnetic fear, I call it the magnetic fear. It's the magnetic atmosphere changes. That ripple in the sky. Some pretty cool ripples. Nice little bird. Anyway, these little ripples in the sky. <clears throat> well, I don't even know what day it is, guys. I don't know if it's Wednesday or Thursday. This pandemic thing, you can't do nothing. You're not normal. It's crazy. So, I'm going to track this as best I can. I like those ripples. And I'll be back. No, the south, the southeast, 
I'm looking at right now, you can see how it's coming up more on the horizon. There's more stuff coming up. Of course, we were looking at that a little a few minutes ago. And uh, the whole thing, I want you to see it. It's huge. It's huge, people. It's huge. This happens when it's in there. I don't know why sometimes I see it and sometimes I won't. I think because it's higher higher up. It's not so much higher up. It's just the orbit that it's taken. It's different than our orbit. It goes in and out. Retro orbit. Let's track these rippled clouds. These were the same ones that were on the other side of the tree. See the system coming up. First planet goes by, I think, is R2. It's so huge. You don't even know it. You just think it's a bunch of clouds. But then you start seeing stuff like this. This could be a moon ripping through. This just could be the vibrations. This could be heart porking. Um, a lot of proof. Uh, Gina on her site, she's showing UFOs like coming in like crazy. Crazy. See how that silhouette of the blue, the round, that could be a moon just affecting the atmosphere, strange. So you got like this base of the planet right there. You know? With those ripples. They're getting more and more by the minute, so stay tuned. Just keeps on coming in. Well, you'll learn to see it. You watch this with me. This is like I'm underneath my carport. And uh, you can just really see this thing. And it comes up. So in the morning, I could tell if I could do a video like this or not. You get this whole planet wall right there. You see how the clouds are going up? That's a planet wall, guys. That's the whole side of the dark side of Nibiru or whatever, I too. You know, it's hard to nail which planet's which. You know, I appreciate you guys that are like putting comments on like, you moron, hey everybody, if you want to come to my channel and learn really what's going on. And so, what makes you the expert again? Because you've been watching for 20 years? Okay. Um, then you go to your site and it's like you got the same message all the time. It's kind of boring. You don't ever show anything really. You show CGI pictures and you act like you're the pro from NASA. So, do me a favor. When you put up a link to go to your channel because I'm the moron, remember that it goes into a basket called trash, spam, automatically. So, don't waste your time. You know, if you don't like what I'm showing, don't come watch it. Yeah, but, you know, if all you got time to do is go around just badmouth people, you know, you're excused from my channel, and I don't mean to be rude. God bless you. Have a good journey. Blessed coming in my channel. You're blessed going out. Bye. More to come. Well, just keeps on crawling over. Now, you might ask yourself, well, Chris, if that's the planet wall, how is the sun? in front of the planet. Now, I'm not saying that's a fake sun, but there is a, a couple things that they've created. China created a fake moon that lights up but like the sun. It drives off in the middle of the night. I've actually recorded it, and you guys can go back on my videos on the UFOs playlist, and you will see it. But, uh, uh, no. So when you see the ring, and the big giant gas herbiculus behind it, like I showed the other day from my backyard. You know, um, you're always going to see the sun simulator in front of that planet. Now, is that blocking our planet? I don't know. Is it a gas giant where it's kind of translucent? I don't know. You know, maybe the guy who's an expert on my channel wants everybody to go to his channel. Anyways, uh, just a little clue, and I had nothing to do with it. He said something about the government, and he got taken down yesterday. So, God bless you, bro. Hope your new channel starts up soon. He did great work, you know? The one guy I'm talking about, he's, he did great work. I watched him all the time. Um, a few people have done that to me. I've watched him, commented good, learned stuff from them, you know? But I'm the moron. And I don't think so. I think I'm the one that has eyes to see. 
what the Spirit of God is showing you people. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get my eyesight back right now because this planet, it just blinds you people. So a lot of times when I do these videos, I go to the next darker level down. So it brings a distinction between the clouds and the, you know, uh, the planets. Just gotta love this fish cam eye, right? Gotta love it. Look how I can get these shots now. Anyways, that's what I'm looking at today. I don't mean to take your time up and bore you in this pandemic, but what else are you gonna be doing? The ripples are gone now. A couple minutes later. There they are. Call them uh, Bigfoot tracks from like Bigfoot shows. Ha ha ha.